to Meek's Tarot. So today we're gonna do a timeless breaker card reading and this one is gonna be fun. We're gonna see your family secrets, like anything that they're maybe hiding from you or haven't told you and see what comes through. Um, so I realized that I don't even have items to pick from. <laughs> we're just gonna have two options today. So we got option one is gonna be the quarter or option two is gonna be the penny. So if you want to pause the video and choose whichever coin you feel most called to. And then I'll see you guys at your pile, bye. This is for everybody that chose pile one or the quarter. So today we're gonna see any like secret family things or things that are just being hidden hidden from you, from your family. And yeah, I just wanna see if like this will be, I don't know why, but I kept picking up like things from the past. So maybe this is like from past generations. So let's see what we get. Got my mini tarot deck today. So what secrets? What secret family? Why am I having such a hard time talking? What is Pile One's family hiding from them? What haven't they told them? Okay, Pile One. What's being hidden by their family? Okay, someone on here at your family may have like secret property. Um, seeing like a vision of like a, a few acres or like a secret house or like a cabin that's in the woods. Someone, um, someone's relative goes on vacation and they go to this cabin. This is something that they own though. And it feels like it's in the middle of nowhere. You may have found, <clears throat> oh my goodness, you may have found um, some kind of record of property or you've been seeing like a map and like you know that your family owns like certain part of a land, but then there's like one part that's missing or like one part that's not labeled. So that's definitely for someone watching. Okay, well, family secrets for pile one. Okay, this is gonna be, not gonna lie, some intense stuff. So I'm also hearing abortion and I feel like this could be your, your mother or your someone that raised you um this is not right but this is what i'm hearing um someone's mother or could even be a grandmother got pregnant with someone of a different race and had an abortion because of the race okay pile ones Family secrets. I'm literally not getting any cards. I just feel like I'm channeling a bunch of things. There's something about like a different background. Like someone has, this may be even like you, maybe you have, you think you're like Irish, but if you did like the ancestry or did some kind of DNA test, you would find out that you're like not even that, you're not Irish, like you're something completely different. <clears throat> it's almost like someone is trying to like hide where they came from or they're trying to hide where you came from. Oh my goodness. Okay, the, take what resonates, but someone, um, your mother or your father may not actually be your mother or your father. 
if you felt called to like getting some kind of DNA test or like doing research on your parents or like seeing where you came from, I would definitely do that because I feel like for someone like you've been kind of feeling like maybe you're not even related to someone in your family and I don't feel like you are. <clears throat> Okay, someone could literally just be adopted. You don't even know that you're adopted. Um, I'm hearing like you could have brought this up to them and they called you crazy. Or like they could start like bashing on you and be like, oh, you don't like you don't think you're part of this family. It seems like you don't want to be part of this family and like say stuff like that. Okay, we got one card. We have five of pentacles. <clears throat> okay, there's also something about stealing. So, someone in your family. I'm really picking up on like your parents. I'm hearing your parents could have stole from their sibling and like, like left them in a really hard spot where they weren't able to like <clears throat> maybe they weren't able to pay their bills or they weren't able to even support themselves at all and one of your parents was like fine with taking money from the sibling even though they knew they were struggling it's okay i feel like a lot of family secrets has to do with like covering things up and making it seem like it's normal or like making it look like it never happened Okay, this is getting pretty crazy. So I'm also seeing someone on here. Um, one of your relatives was like on their deathbed. Or there's like something really bad that happened to one of your relatives. Or this could even be one of their friends. And like the relative or the friend asked whoever this family member is for help. And they denied it and for so, for like two of you <clears throat> this person could have literally passed away because this person didn't help them if that resonates for anybody I feel like the family member thinks about this all the time but like okay my camera just shut off so I feel like whatever we're getting right now is not wanting to be shared with you okay so what else family secrets pile one oh i'm getting so many different messages so again please take what resonates um i'm also seeing that i i just keep picking up parents or grandparents may have told you that their parents have died but I feel like maybe their parents were just toxic and they pretty much just said that they're not alive because they don't want to talk to them anymore and they didn't want to be you to be a part of their life wait they didn't want yeah, they didn't want like the grandparents or the great grandparents to like be a part of your life or their life. Yeah, we got four of ones in reverse. My camera just keeps shutting off. Okay. I'm also picking up some cult shit, so 
I feel like this is like um, past generation, so maybe your grandparents, great grandparents, like somewhere along that line. There's definitely like a church, um, but the church seems like it wasn't really like a good place. Like um, they had meetings together like once or twice a week and they would meet together and geez this is some dark stuff do like some kind of sacrifice um these were pretty much like witches but they considered themselves church people <laughs> yeah let's see what else yeah literally the magician so there's definitely um, people from past generations that were into witchcraft. There's also a message of like doing some kind of witchcraft or some kind of sacrifice to get what they wanted. So this could even go back to what I said earlier, like letting someone die oh my goodness <sighs> guys oh my gosh okay letting someone die so that they could inherit what they have like their money or their property maybe they had both maybe they had money and property um yeah there's also something being hidden about not telling you about what this person owned. And I feel like they they owned some kind of land or house. And like, whoever took care of the will may have just wrote their name in it so they would get whatever this person had and they didn't have to share it with anyone else. Or there's like some kind of bribing, like. This person may have stuck around them towards the end of their life so that they looked like they were a good person and they were going to be there just like a good friend or family member towards them. So this person started changing their will and putting whoever took care of them's name in the will. But this person really didn't care about them at all person didn't or currently doesn't care if this person suffers someone is could even be like helping them suffer or giving them some kind of drugs or something so that they're not actually able to function correctly Okay, let's see if there's anything else. If there, oops, sorry guys. If there's a picture for someone, if there's a picture of like an old house or this could even be in a book. Um, there's like some kind of record that you saw or that you will see and you'll start questioning it and I feel like your family is not going to want to talk about it. This is something that they currently own and I feel like they're keeping secret or there was something horrible that happened at this location. Sorry, my eye keeps watering. Okay, we have Queen of Wands. Yeah, these people or your family just really likes to cover things up and make it look like they are in the right for a lot of things. But there's definitely quite a lot of dark secrets that your family hides. I'm trying to see if I can get anything else. Okay, now I'm picking up. There's someone in your family that this is like going back to what I said earlier. Had a 
had a child with someone of a, of a different race and they give that child up for adoption because of their race. Yeah, they have children in there. These people, um, the, your family wants to look good in front of others. They don't want to look like they have any kind of flaws. For someone here, there's definitely like a secret house or secret property that these people are hiding. And yeah, that's what I'm seeing for your reading. Hope that resonated for you guys. I know that was kind of intense, but I thought this would be a cool reading to do. So um, yeah, if you guys are interested in a reading, link is down below. Also got my, my PO box. Also got Patreon. I have my new Oracle decks that are out now. And they should be on sale soon. So yeah, I'll see you guys later. Bye. Alright, this is for everybody that chose Pile 2 or The Penny. So as soon as I'm about to start your reading, I'm at a park right now. Cars start pulling up next to me. So this is going to be a little weird, but we're going to see any family secrets, things that you're not aware of, things that your family has not told you. and see exactly what we can get. What the fuck is going on here? Okay. Anyways. It's like people arguing next to me. Okay, so pile two. Family secrets. Family secrets. Also don't mind this eye. My eye keeps watering and it's like messing up my, my makeup. Okay. Family secrets were part two. Okay, there's something about a baby. Okay, this is for those that are like maybe transgender or you just feel like you don't really fit in your body like you don't feel like comfortable in your body um again take what resonates leave the rest because i'm getting a lot of crazy messages so this isn't gonna be for everyone but for those that like you don't feel comfortable in your body um or you even change your gender or just change your identity um i feel like you were maybe born with both parts i forgot what that's called and your parents or your guardian at that time chose what they wanted or there was a doctor that just chose which one to keep um, yeah, that's for someone specific. There's something about babies, though. Someone on here could also have a twin. If you felt like you have a twin, I feel like you do. If any of this, like, feels right intuitively, then it's meant... For you also hearing running out of time family secrets were piled two family secrets were piled two I'm getting such like really specific messages so if someone recently had some kind of mysterious damage to their car like their tires were slashed or their seats so it looks like someone like cut their seats or did something like to damage their car in some kind of way 
and your car was like at your house or just at a place that that kind of stuff shouldn't happen I feel like this is one of your family members I'm hearing cousin um, someone that is jealous of you Wow, so many different messages. Now I'm seeing a vision of a skull. What is this? Okay. Something about digging up like <laughs> someone's coffin. Maybe moving it to a different location. Okay, now I'm literally picking it up, like, someone in your family literally could have, like, murdered someone. <laughs> uh, take what resonates, please. Um, but they, like, buried this person, like, in their backyard, maybe even under their garden. There's something about like burying a dead body or digging it up. Okay, let's keep going. And my secret is for pile two. There's definitely family members that are jealous of you. Yep, my ear just popped, which means that spirits around me, so. Yeah, there's, if like things mysteriously go missing or things get damaged and it like, it doesn't really make sense. This is like someone in your family. This could definitely, you're like stepdad, stepmom. This could be your actual mom. This could be a sibling or a cousin. This could be maybe your whole family that you think is jealous of you. They are. There's something very valuable that you had that this person like just destroyed or they even threw it away or they just, they stole it from you. This person or these people do not care about what you own. Yeah, Page of Cups. These people, I keep saying these people. <laughs> um, your family, someone in your family, I feel like also does not talk good on your name. Or they try, yeah, this person like tries to one up you or make themselves look better. Sorry, I gotta roll down my window. Or they make themselves look better when they talk to other people. This person or these family members do not like when you look good to other people. Someone's family member just does not like that you look good in general, like your physical appearance. And they're very jealous of your looks. Okay, so let's see. Family secrets. Child two. Um, if you are your, well, if you know this or you're aware that a family member sees a witch or a psychic, I feel like they ask a psychic or a witch about you, and they they try to figure out what's going on in your life. They have also asked about your future and where your life is headed. I feel like I don't even need the freaking cards, yeah. Bottom of the deck, the way of the devil. If they know a witch, I feel like there's some kind of spell done with hair, your hair. Or this could go back to like, 
that dead body that I was talking about. Um, they could have gotten hair from like someone that they know and used their hair for something or they could have even used their skull or something off this person's body. Okay. Magician. Okay, family secrets, pile two. There's definitely something about a garden for someone on here. There's like something hidden in a garden or under a garden. This is like if you go out to that garden or you go by this garden, you start picking up like a weird feeling. Like that's your intuition telling you that there's something fucked up. <laughs> this could even be a relative's house that you go over to and you just start getting like this weird, hearing cringy or like uncomfortable vibe. There's like something off with this person. Someone on here, they literally are related to someone that committed some kind of murder. Maybe you already wear this and this person's like in jail. Maybe they haven't found the body. If they did, it's like, it's outside. That's all I'm gonna say. Okay, what else? Oh my gosh, this is literally for someone like specific that's watching this, but look at the magician's hand is like pointing down at the roses. So like, if you're looking for something, maybe, maybe someone in your family stole something and you're looking for it. Look by the bushes or by the roses. It's somewhere outside by like a garden. Okay, let's see what else. Now I'm seeing a vision of like a, an old box with pictures. This feels like a spell box though, like or a ritual box. There could be something like that maybe in your house or a relative owns that. Okay, family secrets. Okay, this is, I keep going back to like the same things. Um, someone in your family could actually be transgender and you don't even know it. This person tends to wear a lot of baby clothes. We have 10 of wands in reverse. This person may also wear a lot of skirts. Or yeah, there's just something about baby clothes. Um... Okay, this is another message. You, your parents may not be very close to each other. Um, seeing a lot of fights. And I feel like one of the parents, one of your parents has done something that the other parent feels like they can't get close to them anymore. I don't know if they've done something towards you that this parent is upset with that now they feel like they can't get close with their spouse and they can't get close with their own kids or their own child. There could have been maybe cheating involved or maybe some very, I want to say toxic addiction, but I mean, I think addictions are just toxic in general <laughs> but yeah there could one of your parents could have some kind of addiction
there's like a a guardian or someone older than you that's keeping a secret from the other like let's say this is your this is your aunt well this aunt is keeping the secret from the uncle because I feel like somehow like another person is tied yeah the lovers we have two people there's like another person involved or it involves another person this definitely could f be siblings maybe it's you and your sibling maybe your sibling is keeping some kind of secret from you um for someone on here if you're like close to age with your sibling the sibling could have slept with your boyfriend or your girlfriend i'm also hearing that this sibling may tend to go to someone older than you and like um hearing tattletale on you <laughs> the sibling or this could even be a cousin like tells Maybe one of your parents, or it's just someone older about what you're doing. This person seems to be like they're almost like a spy. This person spies on your life, and this person only does things to like benefit themselves. I feel like the older person that they have been talking to, like, rewards them in some kind of way, like, by treating them better. Um, Maybe taking them shopping or there's like some kind of reward that they feel like they get from this older person so they that's why they keep doing this this person could be we have air and fire so maybe it's an air and a fire sign Yeah, there's someone, like, they talk about your every move. Like, if you're talking to someone, or if you start talking to someone new or doing something different, like, literally the same day or the next day, this older person will be aware of it because your sibling or your cousin told them about it. <laughs> it's like, they don't want to have, they want to know, like, everything that's going on in your life. But these two people keep a lot of secrets together. This could even be three people. They all, it feels like, yeah, like a, like a group. Um, two or three people could be up to four. It's like they all get together and they talk. It feels like there's one person left out, which I feel like for a majority of you, it's you. <laughs> If these people like FaceTime together or maybe meet up and like hang out somewhere, these people are talking about you. Okay, we got Six of Pentacles. There could also be someone in your family that acts like they're poor or acts like they need help but they don't. This person is very off financially, but I feel like, again, they have some kind of addiction or they spend on the wrong things. They make bad investments or this person could be even just saving it all and they just choose to not tell anyone about it. Like this person could literally have like a million dollars. I'm hearing a hundred thousand in their bank account. But they'll come to you and ask you for like five dollars because they want to seem like they don't have any money. Um, this could definitely be a parent or again someone that rewards, like rewards other people for doing things for them. by giving them their time 
their attention or money. I feel like for someone on here, there's like one child. Oh my God. Sorry, this stuff is like a little fucking crazy, but there's one child that's more favored than the others. Cause even this card, like this older person keeps looking at them and this one seems like they're begging for the older person's attention. Um, so there's definitely maybe like money, more money being spent on this other child or this other person. I feel most of you, you're the one that gets nothing or barely gets anything. It's like you have to beg for it or maybe in the past you had to and this other person they don't have to do anything it seems like the parent or whoever this is just spoils them okay anything else because this is getting a little long we have the four i want to say six so six could be significant you have the four of swords These people could also be very religious, um, but I think I said that earlier with this pile. There's something about church or something about following the rules, but these people really don't. Um, there's a lot of lies, a lot of dishonesty, a lot of favor, like favoriting, is that a word? <laughs> Um, a child and not the other one, like treating like spoiling one person and not giving the other person shit. I'm trying to see if I can get anything else. Hmm. Um. Something about the color yellow. I saw a vision of like a, a phone book. Ooh, okay. Again, take what resonates. Someone in your family could literally have tapped your tapped into your phone, so they're able to see like your messages, see who you're calling. If you feel like that is you, definitely maybe go to your local phone place and see if they can fix that or take that off this could also just go back to that other person in your family that's like spying on you um so they're just like aware of who you're talking to or they they keep up to date on what you're doing and who you're talking to um hearing where you're going these people are very interested in your future though. There's something about, yeah, your future. I don't feel like they want you to get far, so these people may try and stop you from reaching any type of success. I'm hearing institutions, so like these people are gonna act like you're crazy if you have brought this kind of stuff up to them. Very much in denial, these family members. Um, someone could also be a cancer sign. Got these two cards. Okay, there's always, in almost all these cards, there's like two People are two animals and then they're looking up to like this bigger thing. So I'd be, if you've been feeling maybe a little like not right with someone that you're telling things to, I'd be careful with who you tell your secrets or who you keep up to date with. 
because it seems like this person is telling someone else as well. Like this dog is looking like it's trusting this orange one, but then this orange one keeps telling the sun what's going on. So yeah, that's what I'm saying for you guys reading. I know this was kind of intense, but I thought it would be kind of fun and who doesn't want to see secrets? So yeah, if you guys are interested in personal reading, link is down below. I also got Patreon. Um, my new Oracle decks are out now and I think we're going to be having a sale on those soon. And yeah, all the other links are down below. So I'll see you guys later. Bye.